surreal when we were filming, especially the finale, because the pandemic was happening. Like, mm -hmm. basically, we wrapped, and two days later, the world shut down. Like, North America shut down. Um, so, you know, and while we were filming, all the other productions around town were shutting down, we were hearing all these crazy reports, toilet paper was missing, you know what I mean? <laughs> it was. We were still going to work, like, uh, we're just gonna keep doing this. So it was, you know, we didn't have a lot of time to really like sit in the sadness and the emotion of like what was happening. We just had to shoot and get out of there. So yeah. it didn't really hit me until I was working, I started work on this new project here in Texas, um, Walker. And, you know, I was, I'm playing this new character and it, you know, fall is coming. And that's usually when I'm in Vancouver is during like the fall and winter. And, you know, the leaves are all falling down and it's snowing in, in Canada and Vancouver. And I've just kind of, it hit me. I was like, whoa, I'm in Texas. I'm in shorts. It's October. Mm -hmm. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not Raven Reyes right now, you know? And it, and it really hit me like, wow, I'm not going to play Raven Reyes ever again. That's crazy. And not be, in, and, you know, we're in a post-apocalyptic world and in the future and in sci-fi, you know, and I was like, well, I'm not in that world again. Like I'm in the modern world getting tacos. Mm -hmm. That's wild. So it hit me then. And, it, you know, I, I hold Raven Reyes and, and the show and my castmates and the crew and everyone that was a part of it, like so deeply in my heart.